If you only knew the power of the dark side. Shirt on, pants up. What are you doing in here naked, kid? Shirt on, pants up. Come on, kid, you're better than that. What are you doing in here with no clothes on? It's an abomination. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It is the baddest man on the planet, the human juggernaut himself, Damien McLeod, AKA, um, I don't know. I don't know. I should even try to add on to that. I've said enough. Now, we're gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna dig in these fools' chests. Let me knock off the corniness real quick. Y'all finna dig off in these fools' chests one time. <laughs> I've been telling y'all, man, look, this fitness industry, this shit right here, man, this shit right here, this shit right here, man, this that motherfucking fraudulent of fraud shit right here. So damn fraudulent. I mean, come on now. I've been saying this for so long. Nobody wanted to believe me. It's as if I was crying wolf and everyone wasn't trying to hear me. Everyone was so, so taken by these fraudulent physiques, just wondering one day, when is the day that they're gonna attain that naturally attained physique that they just seem to not be able to grasp upon? It, it's, it's not attainable, kid. Not in the time that these kids are doing it now. Kenny K.O. has, you know, put, you know, once again, um, another guy on blast. But the funny thing is, he seems to give a pass to himself for similar, allegedly similar activities. Now, David Laid is the subject of this video. Apparently, Kenny K.O. is coming out saying that, that David Laid has gyno. And he's saying, watch the video, he says, He's taking steroids. He's taking gear. He's he's saying, hey, the only way you can get that guy around your nipples like that was he's shown in the picture here, which I'm gonna show here right about now. Check this out. So I don't know the guy, like I always say, allegedly in my book, I don't know him. I don't know what that is around his nipple. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that is. <laughs> Oh no, man. I don't know. I'm not accusing them of doing shit. You know what I'm saying? I just, I just tell you straight up. Some alternative fuel sources seem to be at play here. Now, listen here. Listen here, everyone. It seems to be this stigma in, this, in the fitness industry. People, they seem to want to believe that these guys are showing up with these natural physiques, and there's nothing natural about this. You know what I'm saying? There's nothing natural, not in the amount of time. I, like I say, I'm probably one of the few natural athletes on YouTube fitness. But, and I say that because, hey, I know for a fact, there was never a time where I ever even thought about sticking the needle in my ass. You know what I'm saying? I, it, it just, it doesn't, it's not for me, man. You know what I'm saying? I just get, get a little sunlight on me, get some carbs in my system, and I'm good to go. Now, some of these guys, you know, they, they feel the need to do these extracurricular activities. And hey, I'm like I said, I'm not accusing them of doing anything other than what the people here are, you know. I mean, look at this picture here. Take a good look. Look at it. Come on, look at it. Look at it. Would you look at it? Just look at, look at it. Come on, would you just look at it? Come on, just look at it. Would you look at it? Look at that shit. <laughs> Shout out to Just Testy for the would you just look at it. Yeah, man, that's some funny shit. Y'all check out Just Testy, man. Dude is ridiculous with, it, with the pranks. But would you just look at this shit, though? I mean, come on. What do you guys think? Now, Kenny K.O. says a few things in this video. Now, I, I do want to find the clip where he says it. Let me see if I can find it here. Other videos, you know, with his bench press pre-R, like I said, with his recent transformation video, and David Light had an incredible physique, and like I said in previous videos, I do believe he did it naturally for a long period of time up until recently when he started, you know, hitting these astronomical PRs, like I said, every week. So yes, to everyone that is spamming my Instagram comments and DMing me and tagging me on everything, this gyno is definitely due to steroid use. Now like I was saying, 
You heard that, people. He said his gyno is definitely due to steroid use. Now there is another clip in here where Kenny KO admits himself, admits that himself, him himself. What the fuck am I saying, people? What am I saying? <laughs> Do I have braino right now? That he himself <laughs> has gyno. All bullshit aside, he says him he himself has gyno, <laughs> and um, he says his gyno doesn't come from the steroids that he himself said that he uses you know he's used before i mean he's taken things before he's come out and said it you know but also say allegedly just to cover myself but he's plenty of times he said he's done things you know what i'm saying and he's trying to say well his gyno is from puberty you know what i'm saying his his gyno isn't from the same you know um uh, activities is David Lee. No, he's saying his guy knows from puberty. I've never seen him with his shirt off or pants down. <laughs> Boom! Got him. Got him. But anyway, I've never seen him with his shirt off and pants down, and hopefully I never will. But um, he says he has gyno. Now, to the level of gyno, is it at this level? Apparently, yeah, I don't know. But the funny thing is, He's trying to blast someone for saying they are, you know, on something and has gyno because of it. But, oh, no, not my gyno. No, no, my gyno's a different kind of gyno. Mine's a puberty gyno. Even though I do admit to taking things, how will we know that in high school, junior high, whenever your balls dropped, that that's when your gyno showed up? Hmm? Were you chubby? Were you chubby, kid? Voice just cracked. <clears throat> Did my balls just drop? <laughs> <clears throat> Were you chubby back then, kid? Was it just body fat? You know what I'm saying? Did you have, you know, what did you look like in junior high? Do you have any pictures to show your gyno back in the day? You know what I'm saying? Prove what you're saying. I, I would like to see, because David Lay clearly gave no fucks when he posted this picture here of himself, right? Show us some pictures of you back in the day with this titty fat, you know? <laughs> with the titty fat, boy. Show that. You know what I'm saying? We want to see it. I want to see because I want to make sure you know what you're saying is real. Because you're saying, oh, your gyno didn't come from the stuff that you said that you took. You know what I'm saying? So are you being real again, Kenny? Just like with the Hebel Ali situation? Are you, are you being truthful? Do I have to set up the cam and make another one of those documentary type videos where I'm just getting into my character and I'm asking Kenny K.O., are you lying to the people once again about your gyno? You know, is it really from uh, puberty or is it from the stuff you took? The stuff you said you took, because I'm not saying you took anything. I've never seen you take anything, allegedly. You know, you said you took it yourself. You know, let's be real with the people, Kenny. Your gyno, is it puberty gyno or is it gear gyno? Hmm, what is it, Kenny? Hmm. Come on, Kenny, tell us. <laughs> oh my God, I can't get over the quote, shirt off, pants down. I don't know when masculinity just kind of went out the window. Yeah, I don't understand. Yeah, and if, you know, not to hate on another man's hustle, but bruh, you should have, you know, that's, that's what happens when you either don't have anyone in your corner or too many yes men. That's a cool slogan when you're busting shots. Um... At Brad Castleberry, you know, because he has his shirt off and he kind of pulls his pants down, but he doesn't pull them down. He just kind of sags. He shows his waistline, but he doesn't really pull his pants down. And you kind of, you know, I mean, I get why you say it because, you know, maybe you're not really that creative to really think of a cool slogan for shirts. And now that you got 165K subs, it's time to get that money. But you should have thought of a better slogan, bro. I'm looking at it right now. I mean, I. Not many people even knows what this means. It says, shirts off, pants down. And you're a dude walking around with that shirt. I can't. I can't. Let me get off this subject. There's nothing wrong with being that type of person. If that's the type of person you are, I mean, it's, it's just not for everyone. You know, that's like, that's like not everyone is into serial killing, you know. <laughs> not everyone's into, you know, doing things like that. Anyway. Um... Yeah, what, 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 what am I talking about here? Oh, the gyno. So, like I said, you know, YouTube fitness is full of fraudulent activities. Um, David Laid, apparently, now I want to say this about David Laid. 
his original transformation video, is that even real? You know what I'm saying? Did he really, really make that, tran that transformation naturally? And then all of a sudden now he just puts on all this crazy amount of muscle? Or was he fraudulent from the beginning? That's the dilemma. The million dollar question. Was he fraudulent from day one? Like a lot of these guys are. Or was he natural up until recently? All of a sudden he started putting on these PRs with the bench press and the squat and deadlift and this, that, and the third. Shit. I'm probably sure, you know, when he grabs a soda can, he probably crushes it now because he just got all these strength gains. I don't know. I don't know. What do you think? And speak of the, speak of the what? Look at this picture here of the up next video. I'm going to make one on Ryan Casey again because Ryan Casey clearly, clearly is taking alternative fuel sources. I already made one about it, but I mean, look at this. How did my traps grow so fast? Um, I don't know. Let me figure it out. <laughs> Come on now. Seriously, it's, it's ridiculous, man. And people just eat that natural shit up. Come on, people, don't drink the Kool-Aid. <laughs> but yeah, that's all I want to say about that. You know, just, you know, the, the fitness industry is horrible. At the end of the day, man, let's be serious, man. I do this because I want to train people like I've trained myself into becoming the best version of you. And all jokes aside, I know this video was just a bunch of jokes, but there's some seriousness to it. People need to understand when you're being fluffed, when you're being bamboozled, run amok, lied to, led astray. You got people here, like I said, they're only in it for the buck. You know what I'm saying? You have to be in it for the money if you're going to put on a shirt like that. That's just, I don't understand that. Shirt off, pants down. How about, just, I don't know, come up with some get swole type of slogan or something. I mean, I don't understand what, what are you doing? Um, and as for David Laid, you know... <clears throat> You know, maybe a nice guy, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, you know, how, how much can you trust a person who allegedly may be clearly lying to you? You know, your character is not what you say, it's what you do. And it's what you say. And it's what you say while you're doing it. It's what you do while you're saying it. You know, at the end of the day, can you really trust a person who will clearly lie to you to get, you know, a pocket full of green paper? You know? I'm, where's the moral, where's the integrity, where's the real, you know, care for the people that you call your fans, your subscribers, when you clearly lie to people, you too, Kenny, you're saying that your gyno is from, from junior high, puberty, or whatever, this, that, and the third, let's see some pictures, show some truth, because I kind of feel like you may be lying to me, Kenny, I feel like you may be lying, are you lying, Kenny, I don't know, but yeah, I'm done. I, I gotta get some food in me. I just got back from hitting the gym all naturally, might I add. Um, there will be another gym video coming up soon. I will be showing you guys video of me hitting the weights, which I haven't done in a while. Because, you know, like I've been very busy doing a lot of things. But, I'm gonna end the video right here. If you haven't already done so, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe. I am subliminally in your mind. Until next time. Get to the gym, do work, then muscle up. My adversaries cry like hoes, fully eradicate my foes. My lyrics explode on contact, came in you hoes. Who else but mama's only son? Put the phony niggas up the bar. Say my name, watch bitches come. Now